In December of 1955, nearly six months after the kidnapping, murder, and subsequent trial revolving around the Negro youth, Emmett Till, and his accused killers, J.W. Milam and Roy Bryant, Jr., I sat down with the two men that had been hoisted on the shoulders of white supremacy and later shunned by those same friends and neighbors. I questioned the men, no, not as a journalistic source and not as interrogated witness, but as a southern white man, the southern white men. I knew they did it. That answer was brutally obvious. What this reporter wanted to understand and would look magazine paid $4,000 to print and would several million Americans plunk down two bits to read and gossip over is why? <laughs> <laughs>